going to be filming a four month update for baby Cal. And I didn't do a three month update for her just because life happens and things got kind of crazy with Christmas and New Year's and babies and all kinds of stuff. Like I can't even keep my life together enough to keep my fingernails painted, let alone sometimes make a video that I'm supposed to make. So sorry about that. So I apologize, whatever. Anyway, first of all, do y'all like my new little setup? I got a new little setup here. I finally designated a spot in my house for filming and I have a nice cute little setup to film my videos now. So let me know what you think of my little setup. And I'm gonna try to film all my little sit down videos here. This is actually in my room, if y'all are familiar with my house at all. Callie is little over four months old. She turned four months on January 12th and she had her four month old appointment today, which made me realize I really need to do this video. <laughs> So here I am. She weighs 12 pounds and three ounces now. So she's getting to be a big girl. She has doubled her birth weight almost. Just a few ounces shy of doubling her birth weight, which is awesome. She's right on track where she needs to be. The doctor said she looked great. She got two vaccines today and that kind of sucked because she's been a little bit of a crab today, but it could be worse, I guess. Last time she got vaccines, she slept all day. So I was really hoping that would happen again, but no such luck. Anyway, um, she is a big girl now. She's wearing three to six month clothes mostly. Most of her zero to three month clothes are getting a little tight so we're not really wearing those anymore. I've been transitioning all of those out of her closet. I'm constantly on this like moving stuff out of my kids closet thing like with Cadence and with her I'm just always moving stuff out of the way and I'm like oh man we never got to wear this and then I have to put it away. As far as her milestones she is rolling over she can roll from her belly to her back and i'm pretty sure if she wanted to she could roll from her back to her belly but she doesn't really prefer to be on her belly so the moment i put her on her belly she rolls over and then sometimes she'll roll over to the side to try to reach for something as if she's going to roll onto her belly but she doesn't she never does she doesn't really like her belly that much she hates tummy time but she is pushing up she looks like a little baby turtle with her head sticking all out when she does go on her belly and so she's right on track where she needs to be she does love to stand stand up with support obviously and be held in someone's lap to stand up. She also loves to be sat up and to be able to look around. She's following people around the room. She's listening to people's voices. She's smiling and cooing and making all sorts of sweet little baby noises and it is adorable. Oh my gosh. I just love I just love her. I mean, what can I say? She's just so cute. She is a fairly happy baby. She doesn't really get super fussy. The last couple of days have been kind of rough, but I think that's because she's might be starting to be teething and the doctor confirmed that today so that kind of sucks i was not ready for that yet i do not want that to happen i am in denial about her growing up but Regardless, it's happening. As far as sleep goes, she takes anywhere from three to five naps a day. One right after she gets up in the morning, another one around 10, somewhere between 10 and noon, and then another one in the evening. Sometimes she takes four naps, sometimes she takes five naps, sometimes she sleeps for a long time, sometimes she sleeps for a little bit of time. It's really just a surprise every time of what, what it's going to be. She also does the same thing at night. She goes to bed at about 7 or 8 and sometimes she will sleep until midnight and then sometimes she will sleep as long as 2 a.m. and sometimes she wakes up every hour and sometimes she only wakes up twice. So who knows? It's just a surprise. It's just really exciting every night. You just never know what you're going to get. Not really. I can't wait till she sleeps through the night because I am a zombie some days but I mean uh, comes with the territory I guess what are you gonna do she is still sleeping in our room she does sleep most of the time in her rock and play she was sleeping in the dock tot and then we moved her to the rock and play one time when she got sick and she needed to be at, like at an incline to breathe better but she really enjoyed it in there and slept very good so we just kind of kept her in there she takes the occasional nap in her crib but I will say for the most part she takes most of her naps 
either in her swing, in her car seat in the car, or in the carrier. I am not even gonna stress about it. Like, why bother stressing about it? She'll sleep where she sleeps. As long as she gets a nap, I am happy. So, I'm just like, eh, second kid, you know, not gonna worry about it that much. She's finally starting to get some hair on that head. Um, it's starting to come in. I think it's gonna be blonde, and her eyes are still blue as ever. And she looks just like Tim. Everyone says it. Everyone says she looks just like Tim, so whatever. I swear I am just an incubator for children who look nothing like me because Cadence looks like her dad and Callie looks like Tim. Cadence and Callie love each other. Callie loves to watch Cadence, loves to play with Cadence, loves to watch her run around and be crazy. And she, I mean, she really loves to watch anybody. She loves attention. She loves when you talk to her. She will talk back to you and coo at you. And she's just adorable. And we just love her so much. I mean, she's awesome. She is still exclusively breastfed. She does take a bottle while I'm at work of pumped milk. I am fortunate this time to have a pretty good supply and be able to keep up with her needs. She drinks anywhere from three to five ounces when she's at home with Tim, but when she's with me, she nurses all the time. She snacks and just eats, and sometimes she eats like full meals, and then sometimes she doesn't. I never really know what she's getting when she's with me, obviously, but when she's with him, she drinks out of out of the Kindy Twist bottle. That's the one that we have come to find out that she loves, and it's actually a pretty good system. We like it a lot, so if you're looking for kind of a breastfeeding friendly system, that one is good. She does sometimes take a bottle when she's with me if she gets really really cranky and doesn't want to nurse i will sometimes have to warm her up a bottle of breast milk and give it to her i don't really mind i wish she would just nurse but sometimes she gets frustrated and she gets hungry or she's tired and it's just like ah uh, just here's the bottle like calm down and then i'll just sometimes i'll just go pump and get the milk right back so i'm very fortunate that i've had it easy this time as you guys know I don't, I don't love breastfeeding but i will say it is getting a little bit better i'm having a easier time and i'm not hating it so much now that we're in like the fourth month so it's going pretty well but i think that is pretty much it for baby callie she is the sweetest and we love her so much and i just am so happy to have her and i just figured i would make an update for you guys if you have any questions about her that you want me to answer in any of my update videos post them in the comment section below i would be happy to let you guys know the answers i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you for your patience it is so hard to sit down and do a sit down video sometimes with littles like right now i'm lucky enough that cadence is at school and callie is in a really good mood playing over in her walker so i am super super fortunate right now to be able to sit down and do this video but sometimes y'all it is so hard to sit down and do a video and i want to look nice and i want to have my life together a little bit so that's also very hard i am the epitome of the hot mess mom like it's totally fine i've totally just come to accept that that is my that is my title but thank you all so much for watching and we will talk to you guys next time give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already you won't regret it Bye!